I'll make an art today to show you the importance of a background. First, we'll need paper, pencil, markers, a very dark color, and then a white crayon, some water, and a paintbrush. On the top of the page, I like to draw a flat oval, and then two straight lines coming down on the side, and connect them with the curved line. And then I will draw two more curved lines on the side, kind of like a letter C, and then connecting the two letter C together at the bottom. And then another two straight line coming downward, and then a slanted line going outward. This will be the top of the jar, and then this will be the body. So a straight line going down to the bottom of the page, and then connecting the two straight lines with a big curve, like a little bolt at the bottom. So very simple, this is just a regular glass jar. I also want to draw the thickness of the jar. So I'll make a double line in the inside parts of the lines I did. And that's it, that's the jar. We're also going to make sure that the lines is clean and enclosed. Then I'm going to switch to my white crayon. Make sure it's a white crayon because we want to have some stars inside a jar. And you'll see the results at the end. Now drawing with a white crayon might be a little bit challenging because you're not sure where you're drawing. Try to look under the light so that you can see the shininess of the wax from, from the crayon. And when we're drawing the dots, make sure we are pressing a little bit harder. If you press it very gentle, it may not resist the water that we will paint on top later. Have some of the dots closer, have some of the dots a little bit further away, some of them are more grouped together. Once we finish, it's time to color it in. I'm using a water washable marker so that I can put water on top. First, I'm going to use darker color on the side and lighter color in the middle and then adding a little bit of pink in the center of the jar. As you can see, when I'm applying the marker, you, you can already see that the wax of the from the crayon is already showing up because the marker is washable is water soluble so it's not going to go on top of the the wax the white crayon and after you add water you basically wash away some of the marker on the dots as well that creates a very beautiful galaxy painting i just have to finish up the top part of the jar and that's it to show the stars we definitely need the markers on underneath it to see the stars. Without the background, we cannot see the stars. I hope you enjoyed the video. See you next time.